Hey everyone, this is Rabdeer's blog of Animation Bliss, and welcome to another animated discussion series. Today's animated discussion is going to be on my thoughts on Cartoon Network's current schedule and current shows. And the person who recommended me this video is Drew Lewis. And you can check out the link to his channel in the, de in the description box below. So, um, for this, um discussion video um i actually went online i went to wikipedia and i um checked out cartoon network's current schedule and what i'm going to do with this video is that i'm going to um go through the whole schedule that cartoon network currently has right now and i go through each show and talk about what i liked about whether or not i liked each show or just how i felt about each show overall and then for the shows i've never seen before i'd be like oh well i haven't seen that show before so i don't have an opinion but um here's cartoon network Network's current schedule and my thoughts on each um, show that's been um, shown on the channel. So let's see. So we have Adventure Time, and so far I've been enjoying Adventure Time. Like I've really liked um, how deep the show can get in the later seasons, and I also like his um, playful humor it had. Um, early on, um, I haven't seen like the most recent episodes yet, but um. The first four seasons I've really enjoyed of Adventure Time, so um, Adventure Time is one of those, one of those current shows I've been enjoying a bit on Cartoon Network, and I will continue to watch this show in the near future. Okay, next show is Regular Show. Um, I've really been enjoying Regular Show a lot. Again, um, I haven't seen the recent episodes. I've seen like maybe the first two seasons so far, but um, I have been enjoying the first two seasons a lot um, than I thought I would. Like I, I never would have thought I'd be in, enjoy regular show or the or adventure time but i've been enjoying both shows a lot um i thought event um regular show is a pretty funny show um i've really been enjoying it and i need to go ahead and watch the current episodes of regular show next show is the amazing world of gumball um i've seen some episodes like i haven't seen enough um seasons of the show to really um give out full-on opinion but for what i've seen so far i, I um the show's okay like um it's not something I watch all the time, but for what I've seen so far, it's okay. Um, maybe not as interesting to me as um Adventure Time, but regular show, but it's um a bit interesting. Uh, you know, I thought it's okay so far, but again, I haven't seen the whole show yet, so I'm still trying to um catch up on some episodes of The Amazing World Gumball. Um, but it seems pretty interesting so far. Um, it, um again, not as interesting to me like Adventure Time and Regular Show, but still pretty um interesting show so far. Again, maybe my opinion about the show will change once I watch more of the episodes from the show. Um Uncle Grandpa. Um I never seen Uncle Grandpa before, even though I've heard a lot of mixed um responses about the show. I am planning on um, trying to watch this show just to see what it's like. I did see the um Steven Universe and the Uncle Grandpa crossover episode and I thought that was a pretty good episode, but as far as Uncle Grandpa itself, I have never seen the actual show before, so um I might try um to give this show a chance to, to see what it's like. I mean, when I first heard about it, I was like, ah, I'm not that interested in um, seeing what the show's all about. But I don't know. Um, I might give this um, show a chance in the near future if I have the time to um actually watch Uncle Grandpa. Steven Universe. Now, this is like probably my most favorite show that's on current Cartoon Network right now. Um, I love how the story's been progressing. I love how the character's been progressing. Um, I think that's a pretty good show it's a, like a great show so far and i can't wait to see what's going to happen with all the characters in the later episodes of steven universe so steven universe is like probably the the main show i've been enjoying a lot so far on the current cartoon network so i can't wait to see what they're going to do with the characters in the near future okay and the um next shows on this list is clarence mixos we bear bears um, I haven't seen any of those shows yet, so I don't know, uh, um, my reactions to those shows. I might see We Bear Bears sometime down the road, but, um, Clarence, Mixos, We Bear Bears, I haven't seen any of those shows yet, so I don't know what they're like. Uh, but I might see We Bear Bears down the line, or I might take a look at what Clarence is like, so, um, I am interested in those shows and just see what they'll like, but, um, I haven't seen any of them yet. 
And then we got the Powerpuff Girls, and that's the reboot. I haven't seen the Powerpuff Girls reboot, even though I was really excited about checking out this reboot because, um, you know, I loved Powerpuff Girls when I was growing up, so I was actually surprised that um, Cartoon Network was thinking about doing a reboot for the Powerpuff Girls, so um, I got to start watching the episodes of the Powerpuff Girls, and once I start watching most of the episodes from the Powerpuff Girls reboot, I will have a separate video on this channel about my thoughts on the Powerpuff Girls reboot um, overall so far. Um, at least based on the first five episodes, maybe, because um, I didn't want to judge the show based on just one episode. So I'm going to wait until I can watch at least five or six episodes of the show and just give my thoughts on the show, what it is so far, and um, whether or not it's as good as the original. But the Powerpuff Girls reboot, I am excited about, but I haven't been able to really watch it yet. But um, I will have a separate video um, once I get around to watching the Powerpuff Girls reboot, I will have a separate video um, detailing my thoughts about the show so far and whether or not it compares a lot to the original series. So, that's the Powerpuff Girls reboot. Um, and then some other shows we have is Pokemon XYZ, Lego Ninjago, Master Suspensu. Now, Lego... Um, Ninjago, I have been watching a lot. I've really been enjoying that show, but I haven't seen like the recent season of this series. So, um, I'd like to see the reaches the recent um se season of this um series. But um, I have been enjoying the show a lot so far. So um, that's another show I've been liking a lot from Cartoon Network. Um, then there's um, Teen Titans Go. Um. I never seen Teen Titans Go, but a lot of people seem to hate that show. Um, I don't know if I want to watch it or not, but I might watch Teen Titans Go just to see what it's like and see why everybody hates it so much. I know it's nothing like the original Teen Titans, um, but um, you know, I might give Teen Titans Go a chance down the line. But I haven't seen that show, so I don't know what to expect from it. But from what I've heard, a lot of people hated that show, so um. Yeah, I'm not sure what to say about Teen Titans Go since I've never seen it, but I might see the show down the line just to see if my opinion differs from what everybody else has been saying about the show. Um, the Tom and Jerry show. I think I had that on DVD, but I haven't seen um the show yet, so I'm gonna check that out as soon as possible. Um, it's supposed to be like the newest Tom and Jerry series that was released, so um, I'm definitely gonna try to check out what the Tom and Jerry show is all about and if it's as good as the original Tom and Jerry shorts. Um, then we have Sonic Boom. I actually have been enjoying Sonic Boom, surprisingly. Like, um, it's been a while since we had a new Sonic the Hedgehog cartoon for years, so, um, um, Sonic Boom is looking to be pretty good so far. Um, I thought it's funny, um, I know the video game it was supposed to be based off of didn't do that well, but, um, I've been enjoying the show so far. It's pretty funny, and I can't wait to see more episodes from the show. Alright. So, next on this list is Transformers, Robots in the Skies, Rabbit, Be Cool, Scooby-Doo, Lego, Nexo Knights, and Bunucula, Bunucula, sorry. Um, I haven't seen any of those shows yet. Um, I, I, I've been meaning to watch Be Cool, Scooby-Doo, because I'm a huge Scooby-Doo fan. Um, but, uh, I heard some mixed opinions about, um, Be Cool, Scooby-Doo, so I don't know about that show. And, um, the... Judging by the art style, it looks like Family Guy, you know, which is weird. You know, you have a Scooby-Doo show that looks exactly like Family Guy. So I don't know what type of show uh, Be Cool Scooby-Doo is all about. So I might check that out since I'm a Scooby-Doo fan. And then the um, show that really surprised me the most on this list is Bernoukula. Um, if anybody grew up with the Bernoukula books when they were little, it was about this rabbit who was like a vampire or something like that. I was surprised Cartoon Network was able to get this show, so, um, I, I definitely gotta check out Bernoukula, only because I've read the books when I was little, and, um, I'm surprised Cartoon Network even got a cartoon or, uh, TV series about Bernoukula out already, so, I'm definitely gonna try to check that show out. And, these are like the classic shows they still air. And they are Looney Tunes and Tom and Jerry. I'm so glad they still, um, Cartoon Network is still airing those two shows. I, I actually wish they did air more classic shows like The Flintstones and Jetsons. But I'm glad we got Tom and Jerry and the Looney Tunes um, back on Cartoon Network. So um, I'm glad that Cartoon Network got some classic shows back. I, I wish they had more classic shows. But um, that seems to be good so far. Um, and then some repeats of end of shows. They got... Um, Baby Looney Tunes and Tom and Jerry Tales. Um, 
I seen Baby Looney Tunes a bit when I was little. I didn't really care for the show that much when it first came out. Uh, but maybe if I rewatch the show nowadays, I might have a change in opinion. Who knows? Um, I might give that a chance. Same with Tom and Jerry Tales. I didn't care for the show that much when it first came out. But maybe if I rewatch the show again, I might have a change in opinion. So I'm surprised those two shows are still running a crutch and Epic right now. Um... And then we got some upcoming shows, which is Ben 10, which is coming out 2017, and Justice League Action, which is coming out this year. Um, I actually did a video about Justice League Action um, a few months back, and um, what are my thoughts about that um, cartoon and where I like it and stuff like that. So um, I am interested to see Justice League Action, and I'm surprised we're getting another anime series based on Ben 10. Maybe not that surprised because Ben 10 had a lot of um, spinoffs so far. But um, I'm a bit surprised we got um, another Ben 10 anime series coming up. So it makes me wonder what this Ben 10 anime series is going to be all about. Um, so that's my thoughts on the current Cartoon Network schedule so far. So far, I think the schedule is a lot better off than it was like um, in the mid-2000s. You know, there's doesn't seem to be a lot of live action shows on this um, schedule. Well, I'm not sure about Benicula. Again, um, I haven't watched any of those shows yet. But um, from the shows I've heard about, most of them are cartoon or animated, so that's good for Cartoon Network because that's a channel about cartoons. And at least I don't see a lot of live action shows on this um, channel yet. But again, um, I haven't seen all the shows, so there might be some live action shows that I'm missing out of. But that's the current schedule Cartoon Network I got so far. And so far I've been enjoying half of these shows, so that's a good sign. That means I'm starting to get back into Cartoon Network a little bit. But, um,. You know, it would be would it be like how I watched Cartoon Network back in the late nineties? Maybe not, but um, you know, I I'm, I am enjoying a lot of the shows that's on Cartoon Network currently, so that's a good sign. Um, I've really been enjoying Steven Universe. I've been enjoying Adventure Time and regular shows, so and Sonic Boom, so. Um, those are some shows I've really been enjoying. And I will have a review about the Powerpuff Girls reboot once I watch more episodes of this series just to see um, what it's like overall and if it can compare to the original. So tell me in the comments below, what are your thoughts on Cartoon Network's current schedule? Do you like um, the shows they're putting out right now? Do you think the schedule now is a lot better than it was in the mid-2000s? Please feel free to... Um, talk um please feel free to um, voice your opinions in the comments below and don't forget to follow us on twitter so we can keep you updated any new videos we post up and also like our facebook page well i hope you enjoyed this video this is rabbi's blog of animation bliss and i'll see you later